What is up my friends, it's Sea Saint here with another deep dive into the Paraverse. This week we'll take a look at Gear. Let's get right to it. Gear is an advanced wasm based smart contract engine that touts enabling developers to deploy a dApp in only 5 measly minutes. Whew. But what drives Gear? Well it's composed of 3 main pillars of performance. The actor model, memory parallelism, and wasm. The actor model allows programs to run in parallel, avoiding shared memory, and communicate by passing messages between each other. This technique is well known in the computer science industry, and it's easiest to use email as an example, with each mailbox being a different actor and messages passing between them to work. This independence of programs, aka actors, also enables unique messages to be sent in parallel. Since memory isn't shared or stored together, there is more freedom for these programs to act simultaneously. Hence, memory parallelism. Oof. Now let's try to grasp exactly what WASM is. WASM, or WebAssembly Virtual Machine, is essentially a compiler that translates different coding languages into one that can be read by a web browser. This opens up the door for different languages other than good old JavaScript to be used to create an app, web page, or other user experience. It's a huge hook for those developers in Web2 because most large tech entities have been using Wasm to create applications for years now, including Adobe, Microsoft, and Google Earth. This is huge. And using Google Earth as an example, this was initially intended to be an app that you downloaded on your desktop written in C++. But they knew to reach more users running in a browser, aka just being on the web, was ideal. At first, this was only possible through Chrome. But with the advent of WebAssembly, their application was able to be deployed on multiple browsers with better speed and a smoother user experience. And good sir, Gears bring this all to blockchain. In fact, listen in to what the CEO of Gear, Mr. Salas, has to say about Wasm and blockchain. When Ethereum was built, they had to invent a new language that could be compatible with them. So it, Solidity was built and was designed and stuff like that. And actually it was designed by Gavin Wood. And uh, when he comes to build Polkadot, why didn't he use the same thing he invented before? Just because he understood that there is new technology, that it's much more suitable uh, for the blockchain solutions, and that actually you can write in a language that would be more secure and would lose less memory and less legacy with them, libraries and stuff like that. Gavin Wood must have seen the future of marrying blockchain technology with the current tech industry, as the primary coding language of those using WebAssembly in Web2 is Rust which the Pairverse runs on, and he's even put his money where his mouth is. Gear isn't a pair chain yet, but they are staying active as they have already partnered with major players in the space including Subsquid, the Dotsama native indexer, Balance Finance, a decentralized auction platform, and our good friends at Remark, the king of NFT protocols. Interesting enough, they have also partnered with Polk Assembly to bring this platform directly onto Gear's website. You can listen into their AMA with Polk Assembly to learn more. It would be a shame if I didn't include other projects working toward WASM solutions throughout the Paraverse, including Astar's swanky offering and Super Colony's focus on Open Brush, a tool to bring solidity into Ink, parody smart contract language for WASM. In all, WASM and blockchain is a bridge to Web2 devs, better efficiency, and a smoother experience, and gear is right in the thick of it. Be sure to keep your eyes on gear as WASM branches into Web3. Have a great night, everybody.